Hi, I'm Fernando, co-founder and one of the experts of Brett Launch. So before we start this case, I would like to give one or two comments on this. So first one is that this is a very inter interesting market entry case. Uh, we're talking about a company in Europe, which is very well consolidated, sells a lot, has a very strong market share in the country or in the, in the continent, Europe but they are kind of saturated so they want to sell more and they heard in china the market is just booming now, it could be very straightforward forward to say let's go to china to china and sell this however you have to take a look at three important things first one of course the market is it booming uh, how are the customers how profitable the market is but you also have to take a look at two other points first one is the company in itself the client in this case, how, what are the core competencies of the client? Do they fit with the market they're trying to enter in China? And third point is, what are the competitors there? How are they different from those uh, we are facing right now in Europe? So now you know the situation, let's go solve this case. So the question is, Nutri Premium, our client, wants to enter the Chinese market with the supplements they already sell for sick people in Europe. Should they do it? Should they not do it? Now, now that you are aware of the situation, the client wants to know if they should go ahead with their idea and enter the Chinese market. To be more specific, they want to start with their line for sick people. What are the key areas you would explore there? Okay. Mm. I think I, I got the situation. Let me just uh, recap. Um, so sure. the situation is that we have a client who is a producer of nutrition supplements. And currently they're active in Europe and now they want to sell their products in China. And the objective is to find out if they should do so. And in addition, I should concentrate on products for the sick people. Mm -hmm. Are there any other objectives? 